Hey guys, so uh, just after work one day, uh, I had to run into Sally's because Sally's um, is one of the only, well, it is the only store that has the Beyond Belief um, skincare system. And if you've seen some of my videos before, I love, love, love Beyond Belief. Uh, they have wonderful natural products, cleansers and masks and uh, I don't know, serums and all this other stuff for your face. So I absolutely love it. And when I go through and end one bottle, I cry, I say a little prayer, and then I run like heck back to Sally's Beauty Supply and get the next batch. And if they don't have it, I will throw a fit. So anyway, got into Sally's. And there's one, you know, a couple of miles from my work, so I had to pop in. But I also, on top of that, and here's my... Here's my little doodad so I can go ahead and show you the receipt and not show you, but, you know, read you the prices so you guys know what I'm spending on. I'm, I'm starting to keep my receipts just for you guys so you know what I'm talking about, you know where to get it, you know the prices and everything, and there's, you know, everything's above board and all that. So, first off, the two things that I picked up are, uh, this is the Creamy Gel Cleanser. And I love this. This is one of my holy grails, one of my go through, go to's, not go throughs, go to's. Uh, you've seen this before. Um, I'm putting up an empties video, so you'll see the empty bottle of this, uh, sadly, but of course, you know, I got a full bottle now. And this is the one with the vitamin C. It's the Nourish and Diminish Revitalize one, Brighten and Deeply Clean Skin. And I am telling you, um, I have used this in every single season. I have used this in spring, in summer, in fall, now in winter. It does not dry out your skin. It is wonderful. It's rich in emollients and it's got a lot of wonderful things in it. Um, you just you know, put it on your face and blah, 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 a little moisturize, you know, water, and then just cleanse. And it says that it diminishes, brightens skin complexion and diminishes the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. And let me tell you, I, like I said, I have been religiously using this for at least a year now. Um, I do use some other products I do mix up, but I would say Almost 60 to 70% of the time when I wash my face, this is what I use. And I can't say enough great things about it. Now, how much does this cost, right? Okay. Um, ooh, here we go. Vitamin C. Now, there's two of them here, so I'm not sure which one is what because I have two of these so I'm going to be showing you these but they're pretty close I would say I think I think this one is the seven dollar sixty nine cent one okay um and then beyond belief and I'm telling you they they say BB vitamin Vita C so how am I supposed to know the difference right I mean as far as the little product code numbers here, fine, but I have no idea what the little product code numbers are or where they're, you know, what they mean. So, and then this one is the one for $9.59. That's what I'm guessing, you know, that it might be reverse, but there's $2 difference in, you know, both of them. This one is the Nourish and Diminish Broad Spectrum SBF 15 a uh, facial moisturizer with sunscreen, humectant facial, you know, cone protector solar. So there's the, I think that's Spanish. Don't quote me on that. Could be French. I just read the second line. That's all I did. Um, so it says here, with vitamin C and lycopene to allow skin to feel revitalized and nourished with moisture, helping to diminish the signs of lines and wrinkles. And vitamin C, uh, that's this orange, all the orange bottle lines are the high octane vitamin C. So that's how you know that you're getting the same, you know, bottle. And um, it's just got some, you know, active ingredients in it, of course, the sunscreen. And again, um, you just apply liberally. Uh, let me get my little granny reading glasses on. Is this cute or what? Oh, wow, I see. 
I actually see letters now. Okay, cool. Um, directions, apply liberally 15 minutes before sun exposure. And uh, it says here, it's use, it's water resistant sunscreen. And um, you know, with, with water and if water or sweating, um, Reapply at least every two hours. Children under six months, ask a doctor. Obviously, you're not going to put this. I would I would caution you against using anything under six months for any child, you know, without consulting your doctor. So I guess they're just CYAing in the back of it to make sure that nobody puts this on a child. But this is definitely for an adult, you know, ladies or gentlemen. So this is fabulous. Um, it is, let me show you how it looks like on here. There you go. It's, it's just a nice white lotion. Uh, it has no coloring or tinted moisturizer. I, I guess you could probably rub it in with some of your foundation if you want to make a little tinted moisturizer out of it. It's very emollient. It is very slick. It's just feels wonderful. It just and it smells citrusy. It, it just feels really good on the, you know, face, hand, wherever you're putting it. It goes right in and you can just feel the hydration on it. It just has a great feel to it, great slip to it. Honestly, uh, just something I'm going to be putting on my face absolutely come spring, summer. And of course now, anytime you're outdoors, you should put a, a sunscreen on with a built-in, you know, if you can have a built-in moisturizer and this just uh, answers all my prayers. So it's got the sunscreen, it's got a great moisturizer in it, um, you know, no color. You can wear this probably under your makeup if you want to. Just let it dry a little bit, let it absorb in for about, you know, a few minutes and then you can put your foundation on it. Um, yeah, I, have, I'm, I love it. I won't live without the Beyond Belief stuff. So those are the two in there. And then um, I've been reading a lot about uh, retinol and um, I'm on the fence with it. I, I haven't really tried it. I know it's a high octane vitamin A. Um, I haven't had any products with retinol in it. I don't know if I need it or not but I'm willing to give it a try and I got two retinol products this is um, skincare cosmetics makes this okay this is the night cream all right and this one is uh, made in USA which is great um, vitamin A cream extra strength this has this sucker has 400,000 IUs of vitamin A that is a heck of a lot of vitamin A in there. So uh, let me read this one to you and then I'm going to pop open the uh, box so you can see it. And this one, according to my little sheet here, Retinol N, so that's how I know it's a night cream N. This one costs $10.29, so absolutely reasonable. And uh, I'm going to read this to you. It says, night cream, retinol, vitamin, and rich night cream is specifically formulated to address the problems of aging skin. This luxurious multi-action retinol, vitamin, and rich night cream works while you sleep to minimize the signs of aging. Vitamin A soothes the skin. Vitamin E is an antioxidant uh, that fights free radicals. Chitosin, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. PCA firms and rehydrates skin and then nourishes the skin with silk amino acids. And it just says smooth gently on face and neck until thoroughly absorbed. Avoid contact with eyes. Results will continue to improve with daily use. So um, definitely a night product. I have tried this already. So let me remove granny glasses here. Isn't it horrible? You get a certain age and you don't see squat, seriously. Um, so this is how it looks like comes in a pot like that and it is uh, 2.25 ounces so quite a lot of product in there for ten dollars and change definitely worth it now this has a smell and it's it's a very luxurious cream you see how it looks like butter it looks like butter it's just gorgeous uh, put a little on my finger there it is just so 
rich. Rich is all I can tell you. And I'm, I'm just going to, I'll put it on there on top of that so you can see it. And it's got a nice slip. It's, you can definitely feel that this is way thicker than the Beyond Belief. And it just goes right in and glides, glides on. It does stay on top of your skin. It's not something that's absorbing into your skin. You would definitely not be able to wear a foundation or makeup on top of this because I think it would melt it off. But it does get into your skin, but it does leave that definitely kind of tacky residue that you only want at night if you're not really going out anywhere and you're planning to go to sleep and you would, you know, put this on. It smells a lot like a cream that my mother used to have. I'm almost wanting to say, and this is going to date me, but my mother used to have a cream, a night cream from Helena Rubenstein. And if you gals uh, remember that, leave me a comment below because that was one of my fondest memories is my mother hoarding. I swear to God, she was a prepper before there were preppers. She hoarded tons of Helena Rubenstein night cream. It was her holy grail. And Helena Rubenstein, I, I know I'm digressing, but this is such a great story. Helena Rubenstein would come out, I believe, twice a year with these mega sales. You know, maybe buy one, get one free, or buy one half off. And in those days, and we're talking mm, late 60s, early 70s, in those days, this sucker of a cream, and it, it, it wasn't a pr pretty good sized jar, about this jar, maybe a little bit bigger. In those days, in those days, in the late 60s, early 70s, my mother would pay retail anywhere from $80 to $100 or 99 or 100 She would literally save up the entire year to make these purchases. And she used it religiously every night. It had some sort of um, estrogen in it. Now, come, come later to find out that I think there were some issues for certain people for their skin with putting estrogen on their skin. But in those days, that was the product, the holy grail product to keep your skin youthful, free of wrinkles and everything. And it was, it was a high octane estrogen type of thing in it. And twice a year, I think it would go down to half price. And she would literally buy six, seven, eight jars, just, you know, enough for the whole entire year to keep her going uh, till the next year and the next sale and et cetera, et cetera. And she would never, ever, ever travel anywhere without that cream. Um, and this seems to smell a lot like it. Now, maybe it's the vitamin A. Maybe there was vitamin A in the Helena Rubenstein cream. I don't know. I was too young to know. I was too young to care and I didn't check. So maybe if uh, one of you want to post down there if they if they did have it or not, I would love to hear, you know, your comments and everything about it. But it definitely smells the same way as the Helena Rubenstein used to smell. So I guess wearing it will bring back a little of my mother's memory, which is a good thing you know it's never a bad thing so moving on uh, the other one same company retinol skincare cosmetics vitamin enriched anti-wrinkle facial serum high potency this one has 500,000 IU's so that the other one was 400,000 this is 500,000 and I will read you the back of the box before I um, get too involved here. Uh, retinol vitamin enriched anti-wrinkle facial serum is formulated to restore your youthful appearance by minimizing the visible signs of aging. The appearance of wrinkles and fine lines will be noticeably diminished within two weeks. I have not used it for two weeks. Uh, our unique high potency D3 
deeply penetrating formula helps improve your skin's elasticity. Vitamin A, it says, you know, again, about moisturizing. Vitamin C and E are antioxidants. And then beta carotene is in here and bioflavonoids to condition the skin. And this is to use twice daily on clean, dry skin. Place a few drops on the tips of your fingers or directly on the problem areas and massage into skin. Now this has something that I love. And I'll show you that in a second. I'm gonna take that out. That's how it looks like in the box. And it comes with a little pamphlet so you can you know, read up on it. But one of the things that I love is the pipette. You see, this is what I'm talking about. It's in a nice glass jar. And this one, oh, hold, hold on. Let me see how much I paid for it. This one was $8.99. So definitely not bad. It's in a glass jar. It is uh, one fluid ounces high potency again and when you open it up and I'm gonna squeeze this so I can get it there that's how it looks like do you see that I'm trying not to drop it because you know this is great so I'm gonna put a tiny bit on my hand once more the demonstration hand as they say and here it is so you just kind of squeeze a little on there and put the little jar back. This is very um, much more liquidy than the other the night cream is. Much more liquidy. And you saw the yellow. I'm assuming that the yellow is the vitamin A in it. And it's very absorbent. It goes right in. This is something you can use twice a day as they say, morning and evening goes right in it will absorb in um, you should have no problem wearing your foundation or your makeup over it just give it a chance to get into your skin it's very hydrating again it is uh, I would just say moisture hydration uh, just a, a lovely feeling not a heavy feeling not anything that you have to worry about that it's gonna you know melt your makeup off or anything so I have used this and the night cream now for a couple of days I do notice waking up in the morning especially with the night cream the night cream seems to almost have a protectant film that's the only way I can describe it once I'm washing my face I can feel that there was something on my face overnight and that I am now washing it off. It's almost like a, a f I don't wanna say film because film is almost like a negative. It's not a negative. It's almost like a protectant layer of really good stuff on your face. And then when you wash it off, you can feel it coming off your face. And honestly, I don't see the dehydration in the morning that I usually see, especially around my eyes, and I could come in closer, as you can see. And I am not wearing anything except a little tinted moisturizer today, uh, which is the Pure Foundation, which I actually did a video on earlier this morning, and that will be up here too, so you can kind of check that out. But anyway, tinted moisturizer, nothing under my eyes, no concealer, anything like that. Um, and I did put the this one in the morning, uh, you know, before breakfast. So I put this on, no makeup, no nothing, had breakfast an hour later, went upstairs, put on my pure foundation, lipstick, blah, blah, for the camera, and that is it. And so this is under it. And... So, you know, it's wearing well is what I'm trying to tell you. And any high, you know, it really is hydrating. I mean, look at that. That is, um, ugh, let me get even closer, guys. I know this is going to be weird to look at, but I am not wearing any, any concealer at all. I'm looking into the viewfinder. Sorry if my eyes are going like goofy all over the place, but that is my natural skin, okay? And I feel like it's plumped up, okay? It's, it's definitely like this line, look at that. It's just plumped up. It just feels so good on the face. It feels so good to have it and to know that, you know, you can go out, especially in the wintertime where 
everything is windy and dry and disgusting, I mean, you really, really, really have to keep yourself hydrated. And I talk about this all ad nauseum. I know that. Hydrate, 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 drink, 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 put stuff on. But seriously, in the long run, you're going to thank me. You're going to leave comments below and thank me. And there you're going to say, Maria, you were so right. My skin's so much better. I'm drinking a lot of water. I'm putting the moisturizer on. Woo, woo, woo. That's okay. Don't have to send me any checks or payments. I'll just take the compliments. That's cool. You know, keep on it. Anyway, so these are the two. Uh, let's see. I did my cleanser. Did this one. So I kind of, what I'm trying to say is I'm going to kind of mix and match these. Definitely <coughs> for the retinol, I'm going to give it, you know, more time. But I love what I see already is what I'm saying. Even the two, three days that I've been using it, I love what I see. So definitely incorporating it into my routine here. And what else did I get? Let's see. Um, just Palladio. Palladio is, um, is their uh, cosmetic line for Sally's Beauty Salon. I've never seen it anywhere else. I might be mistaken. I don't know. But um, I just got some rice paper. And you all know what that is. You just take it out and blah, blah, blah. So I wanted to try that. And... Um, Face Secrets Foundation Round Sponges. And the reason I got these, this is a funny story. I bought um, to try out, and again, it's a tinted moisturizer. It's the Lumi Cushion Foundation Moisturizer. I don't know if I've done a video on it. Honestly, maybe I should. I don't know. I picked it up the other day. It's from L'Oreal, I think. Please don't hit me if I'm wrong, but I think it is L'Oreal. And they have like this little spongy thing in it that it, that's the only best practices way of applying that um, tinted moisturizer. So you're going here and going pat, 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 and washing it, it's never going to come out as clean as a brand new sponge. So, this was literally, how much? Like $2.29 at Sally's Beauty Supply. It's a package. It, there's one, two, three, six, so times two, 12. 12 of these, and you kind of like, you know, take them apart. And I plan to use this when I can't stand how dirty the little loomy sponge, cushy sponge thing gets. So I'll just keep these around. I usually apply my tinted moisturizer or whatever I'm doing at home anyway. I don't really carry touch-ups uh, in my purse. I, A, don't have the time. I'm at work. Um, if I can blot my face seriously in the bathroom with a paper towel, I'm doing really good for the day. If I can actually put lipstick on after lunch and not look washed out, I'm doing really good for the day. I don't bring a uh, blush. I don't bring powder to powder my nose. I don't bring a uh, foundation or BB creams or anything to you know, kind of freshen up during the day. I don't have time. You know, if you have time and you can bring it with you, kudos, more power to you. But I do plan to use these in the morning uh, as I am applying my makeup so that I have a clean sponge and I don't get all kinds of cooties on my face. And that's it, you know, life. So, bottom line, what did I spend? I spent... Let's see, the two Beyond Beliefs, the two retinols, uh, the rice paper, and then these round sponges. I spent a total of $43.04. And you know, uh, Sally's Beauty Supply does have those little cards, so you get these points. I don't, I don't even know what I get. I've never looked online to see how much I've earned, but they apparently every store now has that, so you know how that goes. And... Uh, 6% tax, so $45. I mean, not, you know, ridiculously expensive, but certainly for what I've gotten, um, just this cream alone 
in a high-end department store would be over $45. If, if you were going and getting a, you know, a beauty night cream of retinol, vitamin A, top of the line, blah, blah, anywhere in a, uh, in a beauty store, maybe a Sephora or, um, I don't know if Mac even has it, but Sephora, let's say, or, um, Bare Minerals or any, Merle Norman, any of these high-end cosmetic places or cosmetic counters, I guarantee you one jar of night cream would be over $45. So considering what I've purchased for that money, I think I did a good job. Yeah, yeah, I think so. So I hope this was helpful. Again, if you go and want the Beyond Beliefs, just know that they are only available at Sally's Beauty Supply. And, and that's it. And I hope you have a great day. Please give it a thumbs up and comment and subscribe because I love you guys and I want to bring you all the best products. When I find them, I share them with you. You guys are number one. Numero uno. Look at me. All the foreign language today is coming out on me. Numero uno. So you are numero uno in my book. Um, I love you guys. I want to bring all the best to you. And uh, just... Keep well. Blessings to everybody, and uh, I'll see you later in my next video. Bye-bye.